This video describes our claim management with MDON Clearinghouse integration. Some of the benefits of our integrated claims processing and billing management are you can eliminate double data entry and reduce errors. Our software will validate claims and alert you if information is missing so you can fix them before submitting. You can manage claims with hundreds of payers. You can reduce time spent on the phone with payers as you can easily check the status of claims directly from MyVision Express. You can officially identify and correct rejected claims using our detailed MDON report. Efficient claim status tracking from the claims module or MDON report makes it easy to know what is happening with your claims in real time. You can simplify remittance balance and payment reconciliation posting with our ERA module. Some of the features that are integrated with MyVision Express include electronic claim submissions, real-time claim status tracking, claim status reports, detailed rejection reasons to fix claims in our MDON report, automated paper claim submission, secondary claim submission, electronics remittance advice. This demo will cover the following topics, setup for MDON claim submissions, individual electronic claim submission, individual paper claim submission, submitting batch claims, getting claim status, viewing status report of submitted claims, correcting claims for resubmission, downloading and posting electronic remittance advice. You can activate the MDON integration by contacting the MyVision Express sales team at 877-882-7455 or via email at sales at myvisionexpress.com. Submit your provider enrollment details and specify your payers. Once the registration process has been completed, you will be provided with your username, password, and site ID to be set up in the Company Information section of MyVision Express. We will begin by populating your credentials in the Integration Settings section of Company Information. Start by navigating to File, Setup, Company Information. Click on the Integration Settings tab. Navigate to the MDON section of the system settings and enter in the user, password, and site ID provided to you by MyVision Express. Click on the Save button and restart MyVision Express to finalize the changes. The next step is setting up providers. Start by navigating to File, Setup, Insurance, Provider. Here we will begin the process of adding your billing providers. You can either modify existing entries by highlighting the entry and making changes to the details below, or simply click on Add for a new entry. For this example, we will be adding a new provider to our list. Click on the Add button and start by typing the practice name if billing is a group, or individual provider name and address along with the NPI in the Provider section of the Details tab. For 5010 compliance, the zip code should be entered with a four-digit extension. The default checkbox allows you to set up the specific provider as a default provider for all new patient entries. This is optional. If no location is selected, the provider will be available to all locations for multi-location practices. Fill in the parameters for insurance claims. These entries will be auto-populated on claims created in MyVision Express. To comply with the 5010 standard, the signature box must contain the full name of the provider. The last step is to set up our insurance companies for electronic or paper claims. At this point, you should have the payer IDs for the insurance companies you are submitting claims to. If you don't, navigate to mdon.com slash enrollment and click on the professional claim payers listing. Find your payer and jot down the five character payer ID for all of your payers. 
Now we are ready to set up our insurance companies. The setup of each insurance company is contingent on how you will be submitting to the payer, electronic or paper. Please note the paper claims incur additional charges from MDN for processing since the claims are physically printed and mailed to the provider. Let's start by setting up an insurance company for electronic submission. Go to File, Setup, Insurance, Insurance Companies. Click the Add button to create the new insurance company entry. Fill in the company name and address information. Select the insurance type and specify the payer ID from the MDN enrollment site. Leave the payer sub ID field blank. Repeat this process to add new insurance companies. Click the Save button when you have completed entering the information. For paper submission type insurance companies, the difference with your setup will be check the paper claims checkbox and you do not need to specify a payer ID. Once the setup is complete, you can submit claims electronically to MDON. In this example, we will be submitting an individual claim electronically to our payer. We will begin by going to our completed order in the Quick Order module. Ensure you have your patient, physician, prescription, and diagnosis codes, charges, insurance company, and plan selected. Collect payment by clicking on the Payment button. Click on the Claim button to generate the insurance claim. This will open the insurance module and transfer all data from your order to your new claim. Review each tab to ensure there is no missing information before submission. Required fields will be highlighted in red. Set the claim status in the Charges tab of the claim by clicking the Claim Status drop-down. Claim Status drop-down options can be modified by going to File, Setup, Categories, and searching for Category Group Insurance Claim Status. Go to the Provider tab to submit your individual electronic claim by simply selecting ANSI 837 and clicking the Electronic button. You will see a message stating that the ANSI 837 claim file has been created, and a few seconds later you will receive an MDN response confirming receipt of the file and your tracking number. If there was any error in the claim file, it would be displayed in the same pop-up. Individual paper claims are submitted exactly the same way. Just ensure that you have selected the insurance company that is set up for paper claim submission. The Batch Claims module is an easy way to save your claims throughout the day and send off a batch file that contains multiple claims. Go to File, Batch, Claims. Enter any search criteria for the group of claims that you want to batch together. Select Electronic and ANSI 837 for the claim format and then click Search. Select the claims you want to submit in the batch then click OK. The file will be immediately uploaded and a copy of the claim file is saved on your computer. If errors are detected, an error log will be displayed specifying the claims that triggered the errors and what needs to be fixed within these claims. Close the file and click Yes to update the status of the claims. Select the status from the drop-down menu and click on the OK button. All the claims in this file will have their status updated to your selection. The MDN report allows you to closely monitor the status of your claims. From this report, you can open a claim and view a history of status changes from the clearinghouse and payer, allowing you to correct any outstanding issues and resubmit a rejected claim. To view the MDN report, go to File, Reports, MDN, MDN Report. On the Criteria tab, you can select a clearinghouse status, payer status, and insurance company to filter the report contents accordingly. Enter a claim number to look up an individual claim. 
you can enter a date range to look up all claims created within that time period. Click on the search button to run the report, which will be displayed in the preview tab. The report will display each claim and provide details of the submission, including the claim number, created date, status, patient information, patient and insurance balances, and rejection message, if there is one, the order number, payer status, and payer message. Double-clicking on any of the claims will open the selected claim in the insurance module so that you may view the details of the claim and make changes as needed. On the Charges tab, click on the ellipsis button next to the Clearinghouse Status and Payer Status drop-down menus to review the status histories for the claim. For rejected claims, detailed information about the rejection will display, and any information that is required for successful submission will be shown in the Payer Messages box on the Charges tab. To refresh claim status, simply rerun the MDN report. To download an MDN electronic remittance advice, go to File, Batch, ERA. Click on the Receive MDN button. You may also click the Search button to access ERAs that have been previously downloaded. Select the payment you wish to apply and click on the Claims tab. The Batch Payments Details section will display payment details including the date of payment, insurance company, check number, check amount, and more. Select each patient to view the details of the charges and payments made on the claim. You can view a patient's order or claim by clicking on the order number or claim number. From this screen you can perform tasks such as writing off balances, transferring a balance to a secondary insurance or to the patient, linking or unlinking orders to patients, and of course, posting payments. Once you are ready to post the payments, simply click on the Post button and the payments will be applied to the patient's orders.